Rumours Music here in Bolton, and I'm really impressed with this. This is the Roland FP E50. Now, what is it? It has a PH4 key action. Well, what does that mean? It's the same action as on the FP60X, for example, which is a lot more expensive than this, but it's got the same key action. Lovely grip on the keys. It's a fully weighted 88 note keyboard. 211 watt speakers with, that are 12 centimeters each. Giving that a lovely, lovely sound. And what this has is hundreds of sounds. It has rhythms and accompaniments as well, so it's like a, a crossbreed between a, a full digital piano and something with rhythms and accompaniments. You can plug a microphone into it and sing through it as well. This is an example of the concert ground. They even get the harmonics right. I don't know if you can hear that, but it gets this sympathetic resonance of all the other strings, and I think it's absolutely brilliant. So what you've got, you've got minimal, minimal, minimalistic even buttons, so they've tried to make it very simple to get around. Uh, you, you've got piano, electric piano, strings, organ, other, and then favourite. So you can basically, when you find your favourite sounds that you like, you can lock them into memories. Here's an electric piano. <laughs> strings like uh, like this one so if I put this on was holding that on with the sustain pedal any sound that doesn't naturally fade away when you press the sustain pedal it will keep it held on which is another great feature it comes with a, a music rest that goes in there the power supply and a little square sustain pedal and you can also get a wooden stand and pedal unit for it as well I think it's brilliant you've got organ sounds like this and you can, using this it's got two wheels here it's got a pitch bend and modulation which are actually programmable to do other things as well but you can have it doing like um Adding the tremolo in, look, listen. <laughs> That's brilliant. Others like harpsichord. But if we just go back to that piano sound for a second. You get loads and loads to choose from. I know you can't see the screen, but it's a nice lit screen. Then you just literally use the buttons to, to go up and down, so you could get a, a brighter piano like this. Piano sounds great key action. Then on top of that, you get loads of rhythms and accompaniments. Now there's literally hundreds of those in, each with a variation, each with an intro and an ending or a sync start and all that kind of thing with it. But you can also, um, well, I'll just actually show you this first. You can actually layer or split the keyboard, so you can either have, say, a bass down here and a piano up here, like this. Split the keyboard there. You could dual sounds, so I could, for example, have a piano with a maybe a pad sound behind it. Lovely effects as well, like reverb and delay and distortion or whatever, it's brilliant. It puts the appropriate effects on for you, for the appropriate um, sound that you've picked. But um, you can split the keyboard, so I've just showed you the split there where I put a bass down here, but what you could also do, you could put any sound on the left and any sound on the right, and then you can use a rhythm and accompaniment with a split keyboard. So for example, you could play it in what they call like a keyboard style. So what that means is you press a chord down here and you get a backing, and then you can play with the, with the right hand up here. Look at I'll show you. So we can have an introduction. 
nice bit of reggae. I had an introduction, I had a couple of fill-ins and I changed the variation and I had an ending. So something a bit different. So this time what I've got is an electric piano on my right hand. Like that. And I've got the same sound on my left, but when I bring the accompaniment in, I get this. and then it finishes it all off here. Something else I've put in is just to show you some of the variants basically. This one's called uh, Acid Jazz. So all I've done here is I've put a piano sound across the whole keyboard. And what it does is this is a jazz thing. Finishes it off for you. Uh, another variant. This one's more of a got like a rocky sound, and I've picked like a guitar. And using this, I can bend it. I can add a bit of a <laughs> so let's have a listen to that one. Let's see what we can do with this. Absolutely fabulous sounds. But then okay, I can go back to my piano sound. It's also got a feature where it has some preset chord accompaniments in that you can just jam along with and it'll show the chord up on screen. It's got USB and MIDI connectivity. It's got Bluetooth in so you can Bluetooth it. But I just think the sound is absolutely brilliant.
this is the Roland FP E50. It's got a brilliant key action, brilliant dynamics, fantastic features with rhythms and accompaniments and songs. You've got songs you can, oh by the way, you've got songs you can go yourself playing and all sorts of things on it. You can play MIDI files and whatnot through it. You can MIDI it up, you've got your music rest. This is, a, I think, absolutely excellent value for money if you're looking for a portable piano that you can move around anywhere. I don't think you can go wrong with this. I really like it. So hopefully you've uh, you've liked my demonstration. If you have, can you press like because it really helps us. And also, um, go and get one off our website, uh, rimmersmusic.co.uk if you want one, and we'll deliver it anywhere all over the UK. And uh, we'll pop in if you want to have a look at it. I'm here in Bolton. So thanks for watching, and hopefully we'll see you soon. All the best. Bye.